from Chateau Kayak and I'm here today to do another room a day tour and today we're going to do the Sisley bedroom. So I'm going to take you in, we're actually on the riverside here at the moment with our um, terrace and the pond you can see and the river behind you. I'm going to come in through the hallway, really beautiful hallway we've got here done in Faro and Ball French grey, that's the panelling. And we're going to turn here into the hallway which leads up to the spiral staircase that you saw yesterday. It's a really lovely hallway, got mirrors in here and beautiful pictures which I have found in local second-hand shops of French costumes, historical costumes. They're rather pretty. They go rather nicely in here. So coming into this spiral staircase, somebody yesterday commented about the, ex the uh, exposed walls. And you can see here, they're a very traditional method of building the houses here, this part in France, in the Lot of Garonne. And it is like a terracotta slate, a uh, terracotta tile, which is um, lay flat on top of itself. It's very unusual and it's lovely but I'm very very pleased we don't have all the walls like this because it would be really quite dusty. If I can just get the camera to um, go up you'll see one of the only, we've got very few um, of the original ceiling roses there which is rather pretty. Okay so I'll come down and take you through the side hall with mirrors which you saw yesterday and into our main landing the beautiful sitting area here one of my favorite places to sit with the berger suite quite unusual to find a suite of this size quite small um, the sofa is quite small it is actually an english berger and not a french one and it was in a terrible state when i got it and a very clever man has redone all of the intricate basket work here and I've had it recovered in a lovely soft velvet and then we are going to go and have a look in our Sisley bedroom here we go you can see there on the door and we're going to come in Yes, here we are. We are met with one of our baths in the bedrooms. The big bath in the bedroom debate shall probably go on forever. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. I love them. We've never had any problems here at the chateau with the rooms being damp. They're centrally heated, we keep them well aired. They are beautiful. I'm going to pan around the room so you can have a little look. I'll show you later in a moment where that door goes through to, which is the little toilet turret. And the lovely fireplace. Unfortunately, whilst we do have quite a few fireplaces in the bedrooms, none of them are working. Because back in the 60s or the 70s, um, 1960s, 1970s, somebody removed all of the chimneys off the roof. Um, so none of them are connected, but they still look a lovely feature. The really big original, huge fitted wardrobe and the rather lovely upholstered bed which I painted and reupholstered last year. Matching covers here. I would like to just show you uh, these rather beautiful Cecil Aldred prints. I know a lot of you like, like pets, dogs, cats. Cecil Aldred does not normally paint print or print, these are prints, um, things quite like this. They're usually scenes of men drinking in bars. When I saw these, I just fell in love with the little puppy dog faces. They are really rather lovely. So if anyone's a Cecil Aldred fan, look at him on the, online and see his paintings. They're beautiful. So, back to the doorway I was talking about before, uh, which takes us through into the little turret 
um, en suites. Before we go in there, there's another print on the wall there. And that is by the artist Sisley, or Sisley, whichever way you want to say it. Again, not a typical print of his. This is a pre-sketch of his. But I love the ducks. They're so comical. Um, and I based the room around the colours that I thought would go best with that painting. So we go in through the little ensuite door here. Each of the four bedrooms off this hallway have one of these small turrets that sort of sit on the outside of the house, of the chateau. And we've been able to make all four of them now into little toilet en suites, which is perfect. And I love the way these windows have got the ironwork on the other side. They just look beautiful. And into the room where I'm going to show you the view from the window. Many of the windows here are original and we've got the original openers and closers on them, unfortunately. They are lovely. Open the window, here we go. And onto the garden, the same side of the house as the room we showed you yesterday, the Beaujolais room. Looking out onto both the new tree line drive, or newer tree line drive to the left, and the, ori and the original circular tree line drive that would have been used back in the day. No longer big enough to get a modern vehicle down, but we do love to walk around that circle. And that is the Sisley bedroom. And tomorrow, um, I think we'll probably go and do the Degar bedroom. So I hope you join us again tomorrow and I hope you've enjoyed this tour. Thanks for joining me. Bye bye.